Former Deputy Speaker of Malawi Parliament Clement Chiwaya has died after shooting himself in the head with a pistol, right in front of the Clerk of Parliament, Fiona Kalemba Malawi. The incident has just happened at Parliament Building in Lilongwe. Chiwaya, who once served as Member of Parliament MP for Mangochi Central Constitution for 15 years under the United Democratic Front. Fiona Kalemba According to Nyasa Times Clement Chiwaya left a suicide letter that reads. To all those of you that would question why. Don't. Here is my explanation. In my whole life I have worked very hard to ensure that I am self-sufficient and I don't rely on others for anything. My experience with Parliament has been very bad. I am not a violent person. While it would have been easier to hurt others with the means I have, I don't want that to be my legacy. My heart and spirit have been brought down not because of the possession such as a vehicle but the persistent begging that I am doing to get what belongs to me. Is this life worth living? Probably yes, to others. For me the fact that I have taken the issue to various people and I am forced to be begging them to do something is really depressing. I don't have any more energy to carry on. Many of you will not forgive me, but I am down. I have reached the end of my tether. If I continue living I will hurt others, and I don't want that to happen I am already suffering from my post-polio syndrome which is getting worse every day. Compounded by this these people think I am asking for charity, and yet this is a vehicle I bought with my own money. I love my wife Sulia, she has given me the best 11 years or so since I made a choice to live with her. We have seen ups and downs, and she is my pillar in times of hurt like this. Yes, we had plans to wed in December. Ring or no ring, you gave me the best days. I love my children Bubhile, Sandra Crescentia Caleb and Clement Jr. I really want to apologize to them for the pain I will bring to them. My fear is if I continue living I will hurt others especially the people that have decided to make my life miserable that way my family will be ostracized. I am going to parliament and do this to make a statement that I know they are doing this because I am disabled and they don't value me. I would like to thank Martha Chizuma as almsman because she saw the injustice and also judges at the commercial court for their part in trying to see this come to an end. Parliament feels they have the audacity to deny me what belongs to me and I have to go and beg them. I have had enough of that. With a fully loaded gun I could have killed these people but I will go alone. Let them prevail. I want everything that I have to be enjoyed by my mum my wife and my kids mentioned above. I am going with a free mind. Sulia, I will always love you even in my death. Apati Jana Tuchisimina. I love you mom. To my mom and dad in US and to all my friends I will always value the support you gave me through and through. We will meet on the other side. Spokesperson for Malawi Parliament Ian Mweni has confirmed about what he called an unfortunate incident. We have since reported the matter to police. They are better placed to give more details. Mweni said.